linkers here is nothing but joining the sentences or joining the words so raju and his friends and is a additional word it is addition i should speak about all of her kindness towards me places used before after where whenever Hello everyone I am Babita Tamaya lecturer department of english vidyashram pre university college mysore in my previous session i had discussed about note making note making is nothing but a short paragraph where you have to read the paragraph understand the main point and then you need to fill the boxes with the sub points so this question carries four marks in my today's session i'll be discussing about linkers You might be wondering what is linkers, how to use, where to use, and when to use. So, without further ado, let's begin the session for the day. So, what are linkers? Linkers are the words that relate one idea or sentence of the text with other. So, what are linkers? Linkers are the words that relate one idea or sentence. It might be ideas or sentences of the text with other. linkers help us to establish our ideas explicitly they make it easy for us to compare contrast illustrate define and summarize our thoughts and develop coherent paragraph so what are linkers linkers here is nothing but joining the sentences or joining the words it's nothing but conjunction but not completely conjunction so here whatever the ideas we have whatever the thoughts we have everything will be joined together has a linker it means to say that it is to compare contrast illustrate define and summarize our thoughts to develop a coherent paragraph a paragraph will be given so based on that paragraph you need to fill the blanks with the linkers or the conjunction it is not completely conjunction a bit of a conjunction that is about linkers so for example look at the example here on the screen so my mother was an extraordinary person and just see the bold and the underlined words here and i should speak about all of her kindness towards me but i will tell you a secret of mine because i feel somewhat guilty for not having been a happy man in order to have given her a deserved happiness therefore i feel i should have been more understanding of her so you can just see the words underlined here that is in bold letters so these are the linkers that is the correcting words so we'll do one thing without the connecting words if we read the sentence does the sentence be complete no it is not complete without the words the linking words without those words the sentence is sentence will be incomplete it will be not a correct sentence or a complete sentence let me read it out the same paragraph without the conjunction or the linkers and then let us know whether the correct sentence will be correct or wrong my mother was an extraordinary person should speak about all of her kindness towards me i will tell you a secret of mine i feel somewhat guilty for not having been a happy man have given her a deserved happiness i feel i should have been more understanding of her so when i read the paragraph without the words linking or without the conjunction words there does the sentence or does the paragraph have any meaning there there is no meaning so conjunction or the linkers play a key role here without the joining words or without the connection of the words it's not possible to make a sentence complete so moving on to the next one linkers and their functions what are linkers and how do they function here so can you identify the function of the underlined words and mention them in the space given below so here you need to just read the 
sentence or read a couple of paragraph you need to read a paragraph then you need to fill the blanks the linkers are given below fill the correct linkers so here now let's see the connector and the function how it is connected and what is its function here when i speak about add moving on to the previous slide here my mother was an extraordinary person i i should speak above all so i here it's connected with two person it's about the mother and the speaker there so here i what is the function of i here i is connected with two persons see raju and his friends went for swimming in a pool so raju and his friends i is a additional word it is addition so and is addition it is the joining words for two person then raju and his friends so between raju and friends there is a word and that is the additional word or the linkers added between the two persons there raju and his friends went for swimming and the next one but what is the function of but when are we supposed to use this word but it means to say it talks about the condition but refers to condition so for example your parents will give you the permission to go and watch a movie they have given the permission but there's a condition what is the condition yes you are permitted to go for a movie to watch a movie but you should be back by 4 pm in the evening so it is a condition but is a condition they are putting a condition your parents has given the permission in spite of giving the permission they are putting a condition also what is the condition there but you need to be back home by 4 pm in the evening what is the function of but but is used at the time of condition and the next one because when do we use what is the function of because here because when we give some reason because is used at the time of giving a reason for example i scored 100 on 100 in english exam because i was well prepared so what is the usage of the word because here when do we use because he is giving a reason he has scored 100 on 100 what is the reason behind it the reason is that he was well prepared for his examination he was thorough in his english paper so he could score 100 on 100 moving on to the next one in order to when do we use in order to so in order to it is a purpose what is the purpose when do we use in order to so in order to get good marks i worked hard or i studied hard what is the purpose of working hard here the purpose of working hard is to get a good marks in order to when do we use in order to in order to used for a purpose that is if i want to get a good marks i need to study well i need to work hard and the last one therefore when is it used so when we use therefore to give a conclusion so when we are going to conclude the sentence or the paragraph we use the word therefore so for example you studied hard or you worked hard so the result therefore you got a very good marks or you got a very good percentage so what is the conclusion here for the therefore you worked hard therefore you got a very good result or you got a very good marks so these are few of the connectors that is the linkers as well as their functions these are the linkers and these are their functions so add is used for addition but for condition because for reason in order to purpose therefore for conclusion these are the linkers and their functions not only these there are many linkers and many functions which are used in different ways and in different forms before moving forward this linkers is asked for four marks in your examination so it is not so difficult to fetch four on four in 
linkers because the paragraph is given below that the linkers are given you need to read the paragraph and then write the correct linkers in the blanks given below so let's see few other linkers and their functions as i told not only those many linkers you have there are many linkers and their functions here are a few so function and the linking words addition is the linking words for and also besides moreover similarly then what is more such as in addition to to next time the linking words for time is when while as soon as before after till until eventually as long as since and the next word place place is used before after where whenever reason and cause because as that since purpose in order that so that lest result so such consequently in conclusion as result in all thus finally concession though although ever if however manner as as if as though comparison as then not so has condition if unless supposing these are the few functions and their linkers so based on this the question will be asked so based on this the question will be asked so using these functions as well as the linking words you need to write the answers there to write the correct form of the linkers first you should be knowing the functions what is their function only then it will be easy for you to write the appropriate linkers in the blanks here is an example for you that is from the workbook so this question is taken from your textbook that is chapter 11 japan and brazil through a traveler's eye most of the time in your examination the questions will be picked from your textbook itself it is not out of the text it will be from the textbook itself so here is a question eating soup in japan is more dangerous than anything else eating soup making fearful noise is a sign of appreciation a european does not make such noise he will be considered an ill mannered lout the one who makes noise will also be considered an ill mannered lout a well brought up european does not make such disgusting noise when eating soup so this is the paragraph here and you can see the words given below while because if any so using these linkers or using these conjunctions you need to fill the blanks so there are four blanks each blank carries one mark so put together it is for four marks so let's see what is the answer for these blanks eating soup in japan is more dangerous than anything else while 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 eating soup making fearful noise is a sign of appreciation so if if a european does not make such noise he will be considered as an ill mannered lout because because the one who makes noise will also be considered an ill mannered lout anyway anyway a well brought up european does not make any such disgusting noise when eating soup so they have given four words here four linkers and there are four blanks sometimes to get you confused or to make you get confused they might give five words but there will be four blanks but five linkers will be given don't worry just read the sentence try to put the correct linkers over there and then complete the sentence don't be in a hurry to finish it off and give the paper and go read sit and read the paragraph completely 
try to understand and then fill the blanks with the correct linkers. Most of the time, for making the students confused, they will give five words. There will be only four blanks. So, I keep saying this. Read the passage or read the sentence completely. Don't be in a hurry to finish and go. Read properly and then answer it. Moving on to the next exercise here. Alok was happy when, when he was selected to take part in the car race. He gladly went where, where the race was to take place. He was given a car kit so that given a car kit so that he could build the body of the car using small pieces of wood. Alok also asked Abhi if he would help him. Abhi refused. However, however, Alok did not give up. He set out to make the car. So here you see there are five words given here and there are five blanks. Sometimes five words will be given five blanks. Most of the time this question is asked for four marks. Don't get confused. Here there are five blanks but mom told it is for four marks. From the examination point of view this question will be asked for four marks. Yes it is asked for four marks not for five. Fill in the blanks with the right linkers. So four blanks, four marks. A dramatic Chipko moment took place in Himalayan village of Adwani in 1977 when, when a village woman named Bachni Devi led resistance against her husband who, who had obtained a contract to cut trees. Her involvement in ecology with, with her involvement with Chipko that was that was taking place in the Himalayan region. So what did I do in the sense reading the question I have written the answer but you don't do the same thing in your examination. Just read the passage completely first then try to put the words before answering your paper. Try to get the correct answer and then fill the blanks or else you will lose the four marks. That's all about linkers. I'll be back at with another session with items and phrases. Until then, take care. Bye-bye. Thank you.